Magnificent, by when you mention it, this is great and that you're witnessing. Uh -huh. Back on top again, ain't no stopping it. Killing this shit and it's obvious shit. Yeah. Still no accomplishments, fuck it. I ain't afraid to acknowledge it, that's why I'm bombing shit. Yeah, the way I'm a shine ain't no need for no polishing. What is up, Breezy Gang? How are you guys doing today? Before we get into this video, before we get into the shout out, before we get into anything, guys, we got another special gift. From my guys over at Moto Loot guys, so 100% definitely go check them out. They gave me something pretty dope and funny today that's gonna draw a lot of attention, guys, and I, I love attention. It's it's about motorcycle helmets, guys. So if you guys are into motorcycle stuff like that, you you should have a motorcycle helmet if you have a motorcycle. That's that's just how it is, guys. But here's my motorcycle helmet, right? They didn't give me this. This is my personal helmet. You feel me? Be breezy vlog. So if you see me out here, this orange helmet, you know it's me. You feel me? But they gave me something to give this helmet a little bit of personality. Guys, they gave me a helmet cover. It looked like a Viking, <laughs> guys. Be honest with y'all, I fuck with it. I I love it, guys. It gives the helmet... I feel like it'll give the helmet so much personality. The bike so much personality, guys. It'll draw attention, a whole lot of attention, guys. I'm a YouTuber. I love attention. You feel me? So, guys, and I just think it's funny. It's just dope, guys. I had it on last night, guys. It's a real snug fit, so you don't got to worry about this thing flying off. None of that. It's, guys, it stretches real good quality. Guys, they have a bunch of different ones, guys, but this is the one that I picked. I like this. I like this because this this thing have a, has a beard, right? I, I don't got no beard, so this is like my little, you mean, <laughs> guys? So it can fit over the motorcycle helmet. Fits over my head as well, guys. I, man, I fuck with this. Let's put it on the motorcycle helmet to see how this looks. But before we do, the link for this and a bunch of different ones will be in the description down below, guys. So go check my guys over at Moto Loot Out. Guys, they're going to give you such a great deal. Tell them Breezy sent you. You're a part of Breezy Gang. And they're going to hook you up with any type of helmet cover that you want, guys. So let's put this on the helmet and see how it looks. So, guys, we have the, the helmet cover on the helmet, guys. And, bro, I... Bro, this shit is dope, guys. Look at this. I'm a little Viking, guys. Let's let's see how this how this looks when I put it on. Yeah. This shit is lit. I don't know y'all. Don't know if y'all can hear me, guys. But this shit is lit. I can see perfectly. Everything is clear. Everything is fine, guys. I couldn't put it all the way down. Like, it goes all the way down, but I couldn't put it all the way down because I have my GoPro mount here. I didn't want to break anything, guys, so I just stopped it right there. But it can go all the way down. Guys, it's a perfect snug fit. It's on there. It's not coming off. Guys, I don't got to worry about this thing flying off and going high speeds or anything like that. Guys, this thing is on there. It's not going nowhere, guys. I love it. So if y'all see me in traffic with this or with the other style, but most likely with this little Viking... On the RN 636, guys, y'all know it's me, so say what's up, guys. But let's get into our shout-outs. Breezy Gang, so with, with the helmet shout-out out the way, once again, shout-out to my guys over at Moto Loot, guys. Good quality, good stretching, don't rip, don't tear. It's a perfect fit, guys, for literally almost every helmet. So go check them over at Moto Loot. Link is in the description down below. Tell me you're part of Breezy Gang and that D Breezy sent you, and they're going to hook you up, guys. So, with the shout-outs, my guy here said, Yes, sir, none like learning from you, bro. Breezy Gang, I will pull up to the track, but I'm a worm at the moment, guys. First off, Breezy Gang. Second off, guys, it don't matter if you can't wheelie or if you can, or if you can only wheelie a foot or if you can't even ride, guys. Pull up to the New York safety track and May guys, I don't care if you're a worm, I don't care if you've land riding, it don't matter. This is something for our culture. You feel me? For the bike life culture. It's a you we don't gotta stress about cops chasing us. We don't gotta stress about none of that, guys. It's a legal ride out. It's legal. You feel me? Legal. You don't gotta cover up your mask so don't nobody see you guys. It's a legal track ride out. 
no cops, no bullshit, no nothing. If you have a bike, pull up. If you can willy, if you can't willy, pull up to the New York safety track and come ride with Breezy Gang. My guy here said the videos are lit, keep uploading. We try to upload daily as much as we can. Videos going to stay lit, we going to stay doing what we doing. And I appreciate you for tuning in, bro. And my guy here said, hey Breezy, I'm from Rapids. From Grand Rapids, Michigan, learning how to willy. Videos help me out a lot, way more than other YouTubers. I want to have a YZ125 willying down the road, guys. So, shout out to you from Michigan. And, guys, I I try, I try, literally tried to help out as much as I can because I've been through this. So, I li I'm literally giving y'all the steps that I gave myself. You feel me? I wouldn't be giving it to y'all if I didn't give it to myself first. You feel me? I had to safe proof it and stuff like that. So I had to make sure it worked. So I'm giving it to y'all because I've been through it. Because I know what it's like. Like, I'm telling you, I could, it took me forever to learn how to really, guys. And I, fed, I figured out the cheat codes. I was taught some cheat codes. So I'm giving y'all what was given to me by other professional writers and by myself, guys. So I'm, I'm not going to steer y'all wrong. So the fact that it's working for y'all is I love it. I know that it's working, guys. So keep it up. Keep sending me those videos in my DM. Link is in the description as well. And let me see your progress, people. So let's let's get into the video. Guys, as you can see, I, I blew my bike up. Yes. Title, thumbnail of the video, guys. I blew my bike up. I blew it up, guys. So we're going to talk a little bit about how I blew it up towards the end of the video, guys. But... What I'm going to say, watch the whole video so I can explain to you guys how I blew the bike up. But what I will say, double check everything when you're rebuilding the bike, guys. It's going to be the simplest, the very, very simplest shit that you miss that'll cause a catastrophe. That'll fuck everything up. You feel me, guys? So, all the main shit that we had, all the big shit we was worrying about was, was good, was set, everything was fine. It's the little, little small shit that we forgot to do. That fucked everything up, guys. So each part on a bike plays a plays a very specific and important part, guys. So double check everything. Go over everything before you ride or do anything crazy, guys. And it is what it is. Um, I'm actually today. I'm actually about to go get a um a piston. So you guys, it's not in. It's not gonna be in this video. I'm gonna make a how to change your top end video. For you guys, you feel me? Not everybody knows how to do it. Some people do know how to do it. Some people want to know how other people do it. If, if they're doing it the right way, guys. So, I'm going to show y'all how me and Malik change our top ends, guys. So, I'm going to go get a piston. We're going to put it in. We're going to slab it in. We're going to show you guys how we change our pistons. So, watch the whole video. Stay tuned for the whole video so I can explain to you guys how I blew my bike up. What is up, y'all? How are you guys doing today? This is the moment that everybody has been waiting for, that I've been waiting for, guys. The bike is ready to go, guys. Let's take a look. Oh, my God. Guys, let's take a look at the bike. I got the Leptron carb on there. We're going to do a review on that soon once the bike is 100, 100% ready to go. But I got the Leptron carb on there. Guys, and, oh, man. Let's go take a look at the bike. to see how she sound with the first start with the electron guys y'all see that Ooh. Ooh, people say you can't tune with it guys we're gonna find out probably not today but we're gonna find out so first start 
Let's see. Oh, first start. Oh, season. yeah. First start, Bucko. Damn, that joke's 500, right? The car. Have you written this session with the car motor? Nah. You haven't? Uh, oh, this shit is in gear. I'm like, yo, why I feel like that? I was about to cry. Why well, you about to fuck this shit up? Thought something was about to happen. Oh, hold on. There we go. There we go. Ugh. First start, y'all. Let me put the choke up. And hey, yeah, guys, the electron card, the choke is on this side. That's that's some weird shit. Electron, y'all gonna have to fix that. That's some weird shit. Start the hoagie.
guys, thank you for making it to the end of the video. Now I'm going to explain to you how I blew my bike up. So like I said in the last clip, guys, I did not put no type of coolant in my bike. We worried about everything else. We worried about if the new parts warm properly. We worried about if the, the rack looked good, if the, the back fender was on properly, if the Leptron car was working how it should be, the throttle. I got a little mount for my, uh, for my phone so y'all can see me. You see, me? make sure everything, what's the small, small stuff like that? Cooling, guys. So I did all that riding. It, not all that riding, guys. I didn't even go that far. And my bike blew up on me. I'm like, yo, you're not serious. And the fucked up part, guys, it, it's a sign to make sure everything is perfect. Because Malik's bike blew up <clears throat> two, uh, a few days ago. Probably like two, three days ago. His bike blew up as well for a whole different reason. <clears throat> there was something wrong with his piston bearing. And fucked everything up. So me and Malik got to do a rebuild today. Well, it's not going to be in the same video for y'all. Like I told y'all earlier, we're going to make a whole separate how to how to rebuild a top end on a two-stroke type of video. You feel me? So... Guys, put, put cooling in your bike. <laughs> Don't rush the process. Trust the process. Take your time. You mean, bike life in the streets ain't going nowhere, guys. It's just that we haven't rode in so long, so I was just hyped as hell to get back on a bike. Y'all know how it is. I was hyped as hell to get back on a bike and willy and do what Breezy does. You feel me? But I wasn't smart like how Breezy's supposed to be, guys. So it is what it is. We're going to make sure we have everything. Piston, barons, gaskets, Cool it. Oil, everything how we're supposed to, guys. We're going to change the oil. Just because I don't know if any chunks were in there. Because there was like a little small hole. So I, I don't want no more. I don't want no more smoke with the rebuild gang. And they eat my pockets alive, guys. So we're going to go change the oil and rebuild the top end on this bike today. So I'm going to see y'all next video when we do all that. Like, comment, share, subscribe, Breezy Gang. Do what you guys do best. Stay tuned for the next video, and I will see y'all at the safety track. I don't care if you land riding, if you can't wheelie, I don't care what it is. We got baby young boys there wheelie in and just riding on the safety track, guys. It's a legal ride out, so just pull up, come kick it with me and the rest of Breezy Gang, guys. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Do what you guys do best, and I will see you guys next video.